back. Uh, going to go over one of our installs for our cabinet lights. Uh, when we open this cabinet, you can see how dark it is down there. I'll probably put two in here. I've only got one right now. Um, I've got the auto drive LED cabinet light from Walmart. But I'm going to take it out of the package and I'm going to mount this, this one right here underneath so that it will light this this up right here. Oh, you're going to hold the camera for me? Thank you. And then uh, I'll go back and I'll get another one and I'll put it underneath it here and light this one up. They're pretty cool actually. Uh, let me open it up here and show you. They have a recharger cord. Any USB port will charge them. It has 3M tape on the back side so you don't have to use any screws. And this is actually a magnet that you stick on there and then you put the light in. And that it's strong enough to hold the light no matter where you're going. And they come and they're already charged. You can turn it on or off or auto, which turns this uh, motion sensor on. And we can put it on the side like this. Put it up underneath like this. I think I'm gonna put it on the side yeah, because the uh, you put it up here. Everything that's in there is still kind of in the dark. So I think I'll put it like right here, maybe, or maybe right here like this. And then the next one I put in, I can put it right here. And then when you open the door, it lights everything up. Put it on the side as well. You can see how it lights that compartment up. Very good. Mm -hmm. Let's put it right there. Please. Mm -hmm. That is good. Okay. So we're going to hang this light. Oh. We're going to peel this off. Peel this off. as flat as we can. Okay. I'm see. see if that is level enough. Yep. And then we'll push. And then I'm just going to peel the light off so it doesn't have that weight hanging on that sticky. See the sticky rod here? This is what the light sticks to. It's magnetic. I'm going to push on it and rub it. And then I'm going to turn the light off. I'm going to let that sit for about an hour or so and let it get good and sticky. And then we'll come back and hang the light on it. While we're waiting for the magnetic strip to stick, we'll go ahead and charge it up for a little while. I've got a USB port that I can plug this light into right here. Plug the light in and then see it tells you it's charging. And we'll just let this sit right here. Come back in an hour or so and unplug it and it'll be good to go. I'm getting ready to unplug the light and put this away in the drawer. And we're going to turn the light on auto. Right here. Mm -hmm. and auto. Is it turn green? Huh? Is it turn it? Yeah. And then we're going to stick it right there mm -hmm. on the magnet. Okay. And so. then we're good. Mm-hmm. There I go. Very cool. Okay. And close that. We're going to do an install on these lights. I'm going to use this Gorilla Tape. It's indoor outdoor tape. So we're going to stick stuff to the side of the trailer. That way we don't have to uh, use screws. This will hold 38 pounds. These are nowhere close to 38 pounds. So I don't think we'll have to worry about them moving anytime soon. Let's unbox this. This is a hyper tough 1000 lumen solar security light. It is motion activated. Again, got it at Walmart.
and it has the hardware inside which we're not going to use the screws we're going to mount it with the tape so we'll just leave those in the box they give you a template for your mounting uh, screw holes but we won't be using that I just thought it would be nice to show that they included that uh, the instructions mounting instructions I just want to see actually how the light works Evidently, it does have a replaceable battery, which is nice. So, I think it's pretty straightforward. It has a motion sensor on each side, so that it will sense either way, either direction that you come from. Uh, here is the on-off switch. It is sealed in this little rubber grommet. Turn it on. Wow, that's nice, isn't it? Isn't that nice? It's all LED light. The solar panel's on top, so you want to make sure that you mount that up, obviously, and the light shining down towards the ground. I'll get the scissors and we'll cut the cut the tape, stick it on the back side of this, make sure it's good and adhered, and then we'll take it outside and stick it to the side of the RV, right by the entry. This is two-sided tape, and it's thin. Now I'm gonna put this first piece can see it or not right across the top edge <laughs> it got really sealed. <laughs> we just got it stuck up there on the side of the camper take it out and there she is that's what it looks like the black casing that it's in fits in well with the black accents on the trailer it looks really good it looks factory almost it looks really good i like that next just a little accent lighting and it'll light the steps up as well it's they're a dusk to dawn type they're actually step lights for your steps on your back porch or your deck i'm going to see if they will fit because they're a little wide I'm going to see if they'll fit on the exterior of our steps. I want to make sure that the steps fold up with these on there. So I'm going to just gorilla tape them and stick one on and see if the steps will close. If they do, that'll be some really neat accent lighting for our exterior steps. They'll automatically come on. It'll be like a dust to dawn light. They come on after dark. So they will show you where the step bottom of the steps are at. We're not going to use the hardware to drill these in. I'm just going to stick them on with, again, with the indoor-outdoor Gorilla Tape. And uh, stick them on there and try them out, see if the steps will close. And again, it's just like the lighting that we just put up on the exterior. It has a little on-off switch on the back. Uh, it's sealed, so you know it's a good outdoor waterproof seal. We'll put the Gorilla Tape all the way around the edge, just like we did that, so that it, it seals this from moisture. Uh, you peel this off. It says remove sticker before using. Nope. Yeah. Uh, this is your little solar panel underneath. It's just a protectant, protective sticker, so it protects that from scratches and abrasion. Uh, in transit we'll turn it on and that's what they look like they're not super bright but in the dark that will light up your footpath on the way to the steps and just kind of give you a little little extra light to see by see where the steps are at in the dark uh, so that's pretty neat it's just got a, two LEDs and I guess the sensor is in here yeah the dust to dawn sensor is underneath it here evidently because it gets bright enough and it goes out so we peel this off and they'll go out but I want to stick this on the side of the step and see if it'll fold up into the camper so I'm not going to use a bunch of tape starting out hi buddy <laughs> and I'm head and I know it's I'm it's standing I'm standing on uh -huh. a couch. <laughs> I'm standing. Are you having a good time? Mm -hmm. You like helping Dad upgrade the camper? Mm -hmm. You're ready to go camping, aren't you? Mm -hmm. I'm ready. Yeah, me too.
You ready to go hang this, see if it'll work? Mm hmm Okay. Okay, Evan's got the camera. And don't need my shoes. No, just shine down here, show them what I'm doing. Okay, here, let me see it. No, that's okay, you got socks on. I'm gonna put this right here and see how far it sticks out. I don't know if it's gonna clear the door up here or not when I close the steps. Okay. Okay, then. I can't do Just stand right there. Ooh, that's close. But it clears. Yeah. <laughs> Which is good. That means we can put our lights out. So they clear. That's good. Okay. It clears both sides, which is good. Can I get so we're going to hang four of these. Can I hold it? Two on each side can on I the exterior of the steps so you can I see where it? the steps are at. Can I hold All right, so we're going to turn these on, make sure they're on. Yeah. And then we're going to. Really? And then we're going to cover this. This is our outdoor lighting. I am going to stay here and here. Okay, you stay right there. This is what they look like. Mounted to the step. Cover it up. They will light up. Put two on this side. And two on this side. And then we've got our security light now well that's my exterior lighting upgrades for the new imagine grand design imagine uh, hopefully you, those are you like those ideas and let me know in the comment section below and keep get busy living stick with us